If you're new on our channel, please like, comment, comment subscribe, subscribe, and share our video, and also make sure you turn on the notification so that you guys get notified every time we post a video. So, guys, today we have a little something special. We have a few get to know us questions or Q and A, whatever you want to call it. Do you want to ask the questions? No, uh, I think you, ask, should, yeah, you questions, should ask the questions, yeah. And then obviously, it's, if it's relating to both of us, we'll answer, take turns to answer the question. So, should we get started? Yeah, and also, I think the reason that we're doing this is because apparently, me, I've seen it, I don't know if she's seen it. There's quite a lot of people in, on TikTok that has been commenting, oh, where are you from? Mm -hmm. Where did you guys meet? Mm -hmm. How long have you guys been together? So we're like, okay, we're just going to do a Q&A, a little bit about us. But if there's something that we miss, that you guys want to see uh what you're going to want us to do another q a for just let us know in the comment section and then yeah we'll do it in another q a question box so yeah let's get into this video okay so first question guys um what are your full names <laughs> so oh. <laughs> You guys actually want to want to know my 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 government name. Goodness, God, our passport names. My name is Prince Chisum Hebziba Ogunna. The Hebziba is in the Bible. That's a Bible name. If you read the Bible, unless you don't go to church, if you go to church, you will know what I'm talking about. You will know that. Don't ask me where is it in the Bible. I don't know where is it in the Bible. <laughs> Please. <laughs> okay, so mine is. N O M F U N. Ah, okay, not to spell it. Let me out. spell it for them no, now. It's not necessary. <laughs> so the next question, guys, that you gave us is place of birth. Do you know the first? Oh, my place of birth is. Mm -hmm. I was born in Nigeria, town specifically Onicha. If you know Onicha, Onicha is in Anambra State. So Anambra State is a state, and then there's a town called Onicha. That is where I was born in Nigeria, in Africa. Oh, yes, so well, the be. biggest country in Africa. Aye, aye, aye. <laughs> We're joined of Africa. Calm we know down. that. Calm down. You can't calm calm down. compare calm your country down. with down. us. <laughs> hey, hey. Anyway, mine is out of. Oh, I was born in South Africa, specifically Pretoria. My PTA people, gang, gang. Uh. <laughs> we're Hayden, but we're the best anyway. <laughs> you, you know what they're best in? They're just best in Binyash. They just have big nash. All of them got big nash. Every girl you see in South Africa got big nash. <laughs> Next question. Mm. Our age. Die! Let's expose myself. <sighs> should I tell them my government age or should I tell them <laughs> the, the content age? <laughs> what content age do you have? I can give you content age. Content age? 24. <laughs> 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 my content age is 24. For social media content, my age is 24. You know what I'm saying? Okay, my real age. My it's real okay. age is 34. I'm 34 years old. Child! <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm 34. It's I'm 40, guys. I'm not 40. Don't mind her, though. I'm not 40. <laughs> I'm not 40. Don't know, man. I'm not 40. Oh, well, I am 25. She's getting old. Please tell her she's getting old. I really wouldn't be talking. <laughs> See me. You're pushing on to I can, 50 soon. I can pregnant and girl anytime. Wow. You know what I'm saying? Wow. I can, any girl, I, any time. I, no, I didn't say any girl. I said any girl, any time. No, 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 it was just any girl, any time. I, guys, I didn't say any girl. I, <laughs> I, roll back. I can pregnant and girl any time. Say it. I said. I said I can pregnant a girl anytime. A girl, you're a girl, no? As soon as I put it in, in there, it germinates straight away. You know what I'm saying? It germinates. You see them. It, it starts blossoming. Fine. Right, thank you. <laughs> Next question. How we met. Hey! Who's going to tell the story? Hey! Right? We met in a club. Over to you. <laughs> Mama's going to kill me. <laughs> Mama, I don't go clubbing. I promise. I don't know what he's talking about. Anyway. Miss, where did you meet? <laughs> we met in the club. Don't allow her to deceive you. Next <laughs> club, continue the story. <coughs> so, 
Go time, deep down. I had a time I was in like a new relationship or whatever, and my friends took me out to the club, you know. Um, <clears throat> and my friend knew him, so when we got there, we were like, you know, doing highs and there's and then she introduced me to him, and I was like, oh, he, he's cute, you know. He's fine. I, I found him cute for my friend, not for me, for my friend. See, so I didn't. I, you said. I, no, I found, I found, no, really and truly, I found you cute for her, not for me. But I wasn't like, dating her. For me personally. I didn't no, but like I didn't, know, I didn't know your relationship with her like that oh, at okay. the time. Right. You know what I mean? So I just met him. So I thought maybe they were like crushing on each or seeing each other. I don't know. I didn't know anything. So, she thought maybe we were doing pinky pinky, pinky panky together. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Uh, <laughs> but it wasn't the case, guys. I just started getting closer and then we became really close friends. <laughs> Cooking for me, I started taking care of her. Sometimes I bought her groceries. You know what I'm saying? It was, it was, it was cute, see it, yeah, cute yeah, moments. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah so <laughs> that's how we met. Um, yeah, it's been now almost eh, yep. six years. Hmm? Six years, right? In total. Yeah, since we've known each other. Yeah, yeah since we've known each other. Total. Six years, guys. That's mad. Yeah, we've known each other. Mad, yeah. Mad. All right, next, next question. Next question. Okay, hmm. kind of falls into what I've just answered now. How long have we been together? So we've been long. together since um, we've been together since last year. So yeah, we February fourteenth. I actually asked her out on Valentine's Day. Oh, it was so. Oh, can you tell them the story? Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. Tell them. So tell them. basically, my guy surprised me like a whole road trip to manchester and it was at this beautiful like what well, i can't say i would say it was five star hotel i'm not even gonna lie it was really really good hotel um and then when i opened the door there was wait a wait can you clarify to them you say you won't say it's a five star hotel no i would say it's a five star hotel. oh okay oh, okay, okay. <laughs> i'll say it's a no five -star because hotel, I'm... But i don't know what the rating was but it was okay. really beautiful like mm. the hotel was amazing sight view everything beautiful room beautiful so the moment i walked in my guy had set up no 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 from the car park what happened and the, what? the car park and everything Show you so guys, beautiful. we're gonna put some clips. Yeah, we'll insert some pictures. Yeah, it was so so um, pretty. We had the whole bed set up with roses and champagne on the table and the balloons everywhere on the ceiling and then the little cute teddy bear. Like we had the whole bed set up with roses and champagne on the table and the balloons everywhere on the ceiling and then the little cute teddy bear, which I've lost up for it. And then um yeah he had it like written in will you be my girlfriend on the bed it was so cute they had like, gifts and everything I was like, oh, a few moments later <laughs> yeah oh, so romantic <laughs> <laughs> it is so romantic anyway, uh, next question uh, um where do we live so we in the UK. Yeah. Okay, we live in Canock. Okay. Canock, Canock is Canock is here. Wolverhampton is here. Birmingham is here. Okay, so, so it's before the two. Then yeah. I guess. Next question: Family dynamics. Okay, so do we have siblings and all of that? What's our family tree looking like? So, I'm the first kid in the family, and also the first son in the family. Die. Responsibility. <laughs> The born. first born, oh, and then you're a son, like you know, a girl, a son. That's even the worst, you know worst. what I'm saying? <laughs> so, we're four in the family four kids, two boys and two girls me, a girl, the girl, and then our last born, my brother. So, yeah, I'm the first son in the family, my mom, my dad. So, yeah, uh, yeah, I have a lot. My my mother's parents, um, they had, um, I think, six or seven kids. So I have lots of cousins. Damn. Like um, my cousins are everywhere. America, Canada, my cousins are everywhere. Nigeria. I got cousins everywhere in the world. So yeah. That is it. But in UK, yeah, I don't really have any family in the UK apart from 
my mom used to be here, but my mom has gone back to Nigeria. So you really have an aunt in London. I have an auntie, yeah, I was about to say. So my, my mom's side. sister, my mom's right. sister. So my mom's sister she lives in London. So apart from me, we don't that's just what what we live in England. So mm. yep, that is it. Mm -hmm. So for me, I am also the first born <laughs> and chosen athlete. Um, and then I have a half, no, two, two half brothers, and then a stepsister, and yeah, so we're a very blended family because my mom we married, you know. Uh, so yeah, um, there's a huge gap difference between me and then my youngest brother. He's only three, just turned three, literally a week ago, and then there's me who's twenty five. <laughs> So yeah, oh, so, 22 years difference. Oh, 22 years different, man. That's crazy. Um, yeah. So my sister's a yeah, she's 19 now. Yeah, 19, and then my other brother. Half brother, he's about to be 13 soon. So yeah. Shout out to Benji. <laughs> yeah. Mm. Um, I'm the only one in the UK at the moment, so I have no family relatives in the UK. Um, majority of my family is actually in South Africa and then it's my mom and my family, immediate family, who's in Switzerland. Mm. So yeah, this is me, myself and that. <laughs> <laughs> me, myself and that. Don't worry, I'm now her family now. Yeah. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so mm. next question. Do we have any sort of relationship advice for young couples? Oh. Ooh. Um, <laughs> okay, what I would say is respect one another, you know, respect each other's yeah. backgrounds, mm. respect each other, privacy, <clears throat> privacy. Mm. just respect goes a long way, you know. Yeah. Also, they say prayer, you need to pray either together separately yeah. but just pray. always always other. put god in the center of your relationship amen you know what i'm exactly. saying i've been telling her we need to <clears throat> we need to, we need to, need to, to fix, fix our prayers fix our yeah. prayers uh, fix our yeah. going to church oh, going yeah. to the, you know what i'm saying we used to go to the church all the time for some reason i think actually since we came back from nigeria mm, like, we, haven't we haven't been to church and mm. and then the rest of the thing is just leave it to god and then you know as she said respect your your partner you know and yeah just don't cheat don't cheat <laughs> like, no cheat oh no cheat no cheat oh no cheat no cheat oh no cheat no cheat um also yeah just love each other you know love each other strong love each other through everything yeah. the thick and the thin don't be a gold digger don't, don't be that oh because of Something is not going well at this time, exactly. and then you want and you start be be um, be rude or be mad to your other partner. You know what I'm saying? You know. So and then also one important thing: support each other. You know what I'm saying? Support each other. If this person can bring, this person should bring. If this, you know what I'm saying, bring something to the listen. If two of you can bring something into the into the relationship, then yeah, bring. You know what I'm saying? Just support each other. It's really important. And men never ask. What does she bring to the table? Because she is the table, my G. That's what she they say. Is the She's table. the table. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, because first of all, you go to work, you come back, you make food in the house. The house is clean. You know what I'm saying? Everything is running, Everything smoothly. Is running smoothly. So what else does she want her to bring to the table? The table is already there. Already you know what I'm saying? Sitting there. <laughs> the table is there. <laughs> yeah, as well as all these young folks these young people yeah make sure you have your stuff in line so you're stable financially mentally you know emotionally all of it that you're stable you're good because we wouldn't want to get into a relationship where one of those things are not balancing you know because mm. it's gonna it's gonna really mess you up and then you're gonna take it out on your partner Mm. So make sure you're stable. You have your own shit together. that you're bringing into the relationship, and then you can start building together. You know, 
That's why they say it's like a house. One brings the cement, the other is the water. You know? And, and they add, add and they add it together. Yeah. And then it's stronger. It's stronger. Stronger. We're going higher. I'm sure, guys, you have all your stuff in order. Mm. And yeah, I'm just not every time we have to be in a relationship sometimes, eh? It's okay. Those who are single, it's okay. You someone will come to you. Single people. It's okay. Someone is gonna call. Find you. See, let, let me tell you the truth. There's always someone for someone, everybody. Yeah. Even the homeless. They have boyfriend and girlfriend. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me wrong, I'm not saying anything about even the homeless people have girlfriend and boyfriend. So there's always someone for everybody. Mm -hmm. Just with the right and your time. Let me just put your time. Your time, yeah. your time is gonna it's come. Time. It's your time. You know what I'm saying? Just when is your rush. time? It will come. Don't rush and like, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. But your time is gonna come. Next question. What are our hobbies? Mm. All right. So what do you do for fun? What do you like doing? Mm, me, I love, I love playing tennis. I love um, walking out at the gym. Like keeping fit is my so as you can see me like on um, feet. If I take off this, no, uh, you're not taking off nothing. Let me, let me, let me show you something, something. No. <laughs> <laughs> what do you do that mm. for? Look, guys. Where? You see that? Guns. The guns are the guns. <laughs> The guns, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So yeah, man, I keep fit, I like keep working out, like music as well. Music, yeah. Ooh, yeah. I love music. I've always been in music for a long time. Like music, I love music. I love just being in the studio, listening to music, listening to people, recording music. I'm not an artist, I'm also getting me wrong. So but I manage artists. So so, yeah. So I love being oh I love music. <laughs> I love music. You know what I'm saying? Um uh, mine are yeah, where do I even start? Um I love sports, so anything basketball, table tennis, um, bowling, <clears throat> what else do you really like, uh, badminton, mm. all those like physical sports, and then I also love to draw and paint. Is a good um, painter or draw, whatever, like no, she knows, like she is really good in painting. Yeah, I love animals, so I'm taking care of animals and stuff like that. Um... I like hiking and going for walks. You haven't hiked for ages, you know. I know, I know. I, I think since you left your mom's. No, I went oh. with you. Oh, you went with me, yeah. yeah. The one we went there. Uh, this is my video. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Not even there. I went with you to the one that's just here. Oh, yeah. We went to yeah. the one there. Yeah. Um. So, yeah, hiking. Um. What else? All of these, like, outdoorsy things. I'm mm. very much that type of person. But also, I'm also an introvert. So, I like doing things inside as well. So, I like watching anime. She's a big anime anime Music. fan, guys. Yeah, I'm a big anime fan. I'm the opposite. Yeah. I don't like. No, no, no. Don't even, I don't I don't like it. But I'm not gonna. Yeah, I love Family Guy. I love him. Um, I love him. Um, American Dad. I love him. Um, Pink and the Brain. Okay, now that doesn't sound very. Good. It's like ancient. <laughs> Pink and the Brain. Yeah, no, but that was long time ago. The Pinky. Like... The Pinky. The Pinky and the Brain. 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 <laughs> I feel like Pinky that would, was smart though. That would tell you that I'm old. <laughs> yeah. Yikes. <laughs> okay, yeah, that's all of mine, guys. Um next most embarrassing moments. Oh Lord Jesus. I don't think I have embarrassing moments, you know. You're lying. I mean, in your in your whole life, you don't have one embarrassing moment. Mm. Deep, deep, deep. Keep them your embarrassing moments. Mine. Oh, I have quite a few, you know. Once at school, um, girls will know this probably. Once at school, um, I who is that? I came onto my period, and I was in class. Mm. And that time, like, I was heavy, like, my throat was heavy, it was bad, and I was, like, cramping and all that. But that particular day, that particular time, I didn't have any cramps, yeah? So I'm in class, and the chairs are, like, you know those plastic chairs, those, like, colorful ones, are, like, orange or white or blue? Mine had to be white, guys. It was a white chair I was sitting on, and when I, I shifted a little bit, <laughs> and I'm like, hmm. 
you know like i don't know obviously guys won't know this but females you know that feeling when something is released out of you or you know it just you feel it like you actually feel it come out that's what it felt like so i stood up and i turned around looked at my chair I'm like shit <laughs> like everywhere bread everywhere so yeah that was really an embarrassing moment my friend was there she was ah you she know you know wish she watches this one day lovey girl she literally took off her jacket because i didn't have my jacket that day because it was really hot and she wrapped it around me and then we went to like the nurse's office and then they got me a new skirt and everything yeah it was just really, really embarrassing moment. luckily luckily though nobody in the class noticed so i was very much you know discreet like discreet about the whole thing um so yeah another massive moment um Oh, I lost, like, I got hit by a stone on my eyebrow, and, like, I have a huge cut on my eyebrow. Thank God for Michael Bain, because it's kind of faded it away now. Um, <clears throat> I was in crash, and this guy was cutting the grass with those, you know, that, that long, not the long mower, but the one. Yeah, the long one. The long yeah, one. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. So I was really fascinated, and all the kids were fascinated. Like, oh, my God, is this new, like, technology? You know, like, oh, yeah, wow. And I went to the fences by the gate, and we're like, wow, we're sticking our heads out. Huh. That guy just hit a stone and the stone went <laughs> and hit me right there. Thank God I didn't hit my eye. Because if I hit my eye, I would be blind right now. I would, be, I would literally have lost my eye that day. Mm. So, God was with me that day. Me and my stupidity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't think of anything? I can't think of any embarrassing Ah, moments. baby. I can't. Do you know embarrassing moments? I don't know if I've had any embarrassing moments. No, I'm trying to think. I'm I sure I've had. I don't think so. Maybe I have, but I can't remember, but I don't think I have. One eternity later. We'll come back to that. <laughs> <laughs> Next, um, would uh would we get matching tattoos? Well, we already do. We already have matching <laughs> tattoos, guys. We already do. They're yeah. different, so, obviously. But well, I'm just gonna show you guys. Animal. So, um, that is mine, yeah. And that's my that's is the missus one so you can see so the dragon. dragon can you see that so the dragon really yeah i think I, need... <laughs> I don't like shaving guys mm, no, well okay. yeah that's machine tattoo we got together yeah so, painful as hell yeah we're gonna get another one mm, maybe later i guess <laughs> To be um, going out and um, taking a walk, nice on the be on the beach. That's your ideal uh, first date. Mm. First date. That's mm. what you're gonna do. Mm. You wanna see your, uh, the girl in the bikini? You no, this is a bikini. Nasty. I said on the beach. Nasty taking man. a walk, holding hands, you know, enjoying each other's moment with the um, breeze blowing off, you know. Nicely, you know, you know. Okay, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'd say mine would be um either picnic or. So what's the difference between picnic and the beach? Because in the beach you're gonna probably yeah, you know, take a walk and then probably you also chill in the, in the beach and then you probably eat something so the same thing. When you're Beach, I'm thinking like obviously you guys in swimsuits, you don't go there fully dressed. No, I'm gonna definitely go. It's, it's gonna be like picnic, so, like it's gonna be like chilling. Okay, if you're having, having a picnic like, at the beach, yeah, that's fine. That's, that's what I mean. Yeah. But that's what I mean. Yeah. Not going there to swim. No, just, no, 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 like too much for a first date. No, 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 no. Um, yeah, so mine either be a picnic or like going on like some kind of like it's like outdoor activity. Mm, so yeah. either going to definitely. um, mini golf or. Go karting, or go karting, yeah. things like that. Yeah. And things are like fun. Guys get to know each other's weaknesses mm -hmm. and strengths, and yeah. you know have fun. At the See, that's it. Beach is good. When you finish having nice, like yeah, the fruit, fruit and everything, it. and then you can walk, and you guys are talking, trying to know each other and everything. You know, you know, sweet. It's romantic. It's nice. Okay, so. <laughs> Take me to the beach then. Mm -hmm. <laughs> England does not <have> beach. <laughs> How many beach do you have? <laughs> Our first.
first date. It was our first date, babe. Our first date. Um, I think, I think we went to went went for a meal. Yeah, I think you took me to Cosmos. Yeah, um, which is like this uh, continental intercontinental restaurant mm. uh, buffet vibes. They do quite like everything. They really good guys. Everything expensive they do but good. Yeah. Yeah, that was our first day. It's so yeah. cute. Can't say. Um. Okay. Do we plan on selling merch? Um. Yeah, we do. We do in the very near future. She's gonna be the one dealing with all the artwork, all the like everything, you know what I'm saying? Like she's good with that. So I'm yeah, we definitely it. should be designing it like maybe you know, I don't they know us it's TikTok as Wahala people, like we're Wahala. So we might get a lot of words with Wahala and mm -hmm. stuff, you know what I'm saying? Some so many things like they, they think we're Wahala couple. Right? Yeah, I would think we would have mixed like Nigerian and South African. And South African yeah. things. So, so I feel like it's so important because I feel we're very backwards in Africa. I don't know why, but we're very backwards. Just a quick story time. A lot a lot of the comments were saying things like, Why am I with a Nigerian guy? Mm. And I'm just like, what does that even matter whether he's Nigerian? He could be Indian, he could be Chinese, mm. he could be anything. Why does it matter? Why does ethnicity matter? Mm. What, you know? So I just want people to understand that love doesn't have a race doesn't have color no color doesn't have ethnicity it has, mm. doesn't have any of those things if you love someone you love them for who they are yeah. as a person mm. the reason why i i mean south african people yeah i love my people to like i love them a lot but i just didn't want to be with a south african guy exactly so it's life. just like me i was just like <laughs> i'm nigerian but i love my people like ask her she went to nigeria i love my people but i can't be with a nigerian girl sorry I don't know for some reason, but I can't. You know what I'm saying? Like, let's just, I'll just put it that way. I don't need to go too deep into it, but I can't be with a Nigerian girl. I love my people. I have two sisters and stuff. I like Nigerians and stuff, but I can't just, like, it's a preference. Every, like I said, everyone has, everyone has a preference. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, we do have much coming soon, guys. Don't worry. Favorite things to do together? Wolf. Well, we like going on walks together. Yeah. We're not going to play going basketball to, together. We love going to the gym together. Going to the gym together. Yeah. We love going to the movies. Together. Going to the movies yeah. together. <laughs> <laughs> going out to dinner together. Mm -hmm. Things like that, you know. We there's a program we watch a lot, both of oh, us. Yeah. We watch um Flatmates, Flatmates on Showmax. Yeah, we yeah. watch. We started. We we watched um The Wife. We finished oh, The yeah. Wife. Yeah. Wife is on board. Any program, pro most programs on Showmax, we love watching it together. Mm -hmm. Like, we always love to watch it together. And when she's ahead, I always scream at her. Because <laughs> <laughs> taking your sweet time. <laughs> um, let's see, next question. Have we traveled to different countries together? Yes, Yo, we have. I booked so, a surprise holiday. He did indeed. <laughs> he took me to Portugal. Well, Portugal. Um, that was really, really nice. I wish mm. we could stay there longer. Guys, we missed our flights. Like, that's a whole story. We so have to. Old, I know. Let's just leave it that way. Yeah. That's straight down the zone. <laughs> we'll tell you guys the whole There's so many things that happened on that night. That day was just <laughs> a lot. Wow. That was a lot. Um, and then uh, he came to South Africa. Last, uh, last year. Last year. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Last year, yeah, yeah. So last year, yeah. she went to South Africa and then, no, I went to Nigeria and then she was in the UK. And then later on, she went to South Africa that same month. And then I met her in South Africa. Yeah. And then that was my first time in South Africa. South Africa is beautiful, guys. If you're anywhere in the world, I'm not talking about Nigeria alone. If you're anywhere in the world and you want to go on holiday, go find go to holiday in South Africa. Visit South Africa. I'm not saying you should visit Nigeria. Visit my country. This nice place in Nigeria. Don't just come to my country. Don't just come to that country. But be, I'm just saying, South Africa is beautiful. It's it's it's, it's gorgeous. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. So I met her. We went there, and then and then we came back to the UK together. Yeah. And then this year March. We went to Nigeria together. together. Yes. She went to Nigeria for the first time. Guys, <laughs> Nigeria. Yeah. If I could just sum it up in a nutshell, it vibes, mm. vibes, real vibes. Like I wish I could have done more. Mm. There it wasn't was our so... our finance was a bit. Yeah, we didn't plan it. We didn't plan well. it very well. So our finance well. was too this. Yeah, at the beginning we enjoyed a lot. Do yeah. this thing. 
we're just spending money and like stayed there for too long i think yeah as well, like six weeks six weeks come on we'll go to the jet for six weeks come on tell me if you're living in the uk i'm telling you the fact there's, there's nobody that lives in the uk there's nobody, not visit not someone that visited the uk or person that lived permanent in the uk that actually go to nigeria for more than two weeks as soon as it's getting to two weeks you're like okay i'm done you're coming back you know what i'm saying but don't get me wrong if you got money uh, you can flex. stay here as long as you like and flex nigeria is full of flexing man mm -hmm. like it's vibe upon vibe you know what i'm saying and the food is amazing ah man i miss my food mm. i miss the kimchi and suya i miss the suya <laughs> <laughs> she is suya so much and the goat meats mm -mm. Mm -hmm. yeah that goat meat from that hotel oh. every morning mm -hmm. see that's why i want to finish over in that hotel it was right? cool food. It was cool food. <laughs> every morning the miss is going to eat that goat meat <laughs> every morning <laughs> Um, next question When do we plan on having children? Hey. Oh my god Guys Long ones We down. are trying to yeah. build hmm? What do you say? Wait, it's oh, I thought you said we were trying No, 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 trying, no, no. <laughs> I'm saying we are trying to like build ourselves, you know, build something for ourselves, you know, make something for ourselves, you know, you know. Be, I don't want to bring, I don't want us to bring a kid and then, mm. and then there's nothing struggling. struggling and stuff. So now we're just hustling and hustling, doing as much hustle we need to do. Any hustle, any any other like it's good to have multiple. I said it's good to have multiple income, different places and stuff. So just doing as much as we can do to build something for ourselves and then when we know that we're stable we're okay and then yeah we can now bring a kid into the world mm. yeah you said it point blank period who said i love you first and when oh, it's probably her hi 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 what hi, hi boo hi. me where you i don't think <laughs> I'm not that moist. Yo, she's very moist. Ah, <laughs> I'm not, I'm not. She is very moist. Mm -mm. Like, it was him. You know why moist. I know it was him? Let me tell you why I think it was him. Why do you think because it was him? Because he approached me first about dating together, like me and him actually being a thing. Because I remember we're in the car. I remember when we going to McDonald's and you didn't deliver his and I was with you like a fucking puppy. <laughs> like a love puppy. I was following. I went with you and then you were like, oh, um, what do you think about doing like social media and stuff like that? And mm. Do you remember mm. the whole conversation? Mm. Yeah, and I said to that's you. That's kind of you oh, you are into that YouTube. Into you want to yeah, do, do YouTube. Mm -hmm. You want to be a YouTuber. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And that was it. But what, is, what how does this have to say, do? It does because you put the idea into the air, into the universe saying that we should be a thing. And that's why I'm thinking you're the one that said it first because... That's yeah, it doesn't make sense. It makes sense. It makes sense. I think sense. she's the one that because said it. It, it was in his because mind. Because she was very loving dobby. Him. She was I was loving dobby, don't get me wrong, but she was very, very loving dobby. Like she won me every time to herself. Even till now. She won me all to herself every single time. Hey. Like she doesn't if I go out, <laughs> babe, where are you? <laughs> when are you coming back? <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Oh, whatever. Anyway, I think it was him, but mm, I can't, we, can't we, we agreed to disagree, but I think it was her. So let's just agree to disagree. Next question How do you find. Eh? Okay, so how do you find sustained true love despite hard times? Yeah, so it falls into what we said earlier um, just respecting each other, you know and supporting one another when things are rough don't you know call it quits so quickly because mm. you'll find that you know they say it's better to date the devil you know than to go than the angel you don't know. know you know what i'm saying so try and make it work communication is better communication, yeah, communication is, is important like, important like, yeah that's that's all that's yeah that's yeah that is it's very and important. I think a lot of couples struggle with that. Relation with communication, communication, you know what I'm saying? There's no very really good communication mm -hmm. going flowing together. So and that causes issue because no one is saying their mind. Everything yeah. is just built up in, in in them 
and then my time is like is they're about to say it is exploded already exactly. you know what so i'm saying keeping things in and all that is not healthy at all um how do we sustain the love well you need to do things that you guys love doing individually together. In, and, and together. together as well like mm. make sure that you're taking care of yourself first yeah and make sure you're happy with yeah. you yeah. and then you can bring that happiness into, into relationship. relationship so go out go see different things you know go explore mm. um you know just uh, just just, just check body check body <laughs> just do somehow anyways uh, don't be afraid to just you know sh just show a little bit of you know <laughs> i'm joking i'm kidding <laughs> i'm joking but now what i mean is like just dress nice sometimes mm. for your man you know you mm. might want to see you in a headscarf and mm. a gown all day all day. the time like just look cute she's always looking quiet. beautiful every day you know mm. Yeah, because someone called me ugly. Did I call you ugly? <laughs> I'm joking. I don't call her ugly. Yeah, big head. Eh, me, I always feel like beautiful. She's every no, day. He really does. Ah. He compliments me every day. Sometimes we get sick of it. Ah, she gets sick of me. She'll be looking at me, giving me eye. Who, who, who are you telling that? I'm telling you. <laughs> <laughs> no, but when it comes to us, he does. He does. Oh. Yeah, so compliment also each other, you know? Mm each other every day that you love each other most important don't just assume because you're together that the partner knows that you love them mm, i know say it, though. Say it. it show it always show exactly <laughs> yes. Yes. last but not least do we have any pets no we don't and yeah? we don't we don't we don't intend to get any pets <laughs> he's horrible babe. we have fish oh yeah sorry oh my okay. god oh sorry fish. i forgot <laughs> He Guys, the sorry, the reason the I said Buddha is because the fish, ever. the pet belongs to her. I bought it for her. You know what I'm saying? She's been crying. She wants pet, she wants this, she wants that. I said, okay, no problem. I'll get you fish. After fish, now she turned to dog. She said she wants dog. <laughs> no, From let's dog. Even go no, 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 let's go let's there. Let's not go there, From dog. Because From I dog. said I want From a dog. She said she wanted. From dog. I said I want a dog. From a dog, she said she wanted a rabbit. From a rabbit, yesterday she was telling me cow. She wants cow. Like, I should buy a cow. I should buy a cow and put in the garden, in, the, in our garden. The, in our garden. Jesus. Guys, <laughs> when your woman tell you she want pet, don't, don't, don't just think that, oh, it's also one pet she's looking for. No, she will say that one, if she wants to get that one pet, she will tell you the next pet that she wants to get. Me, I nowadays, I just avoid it. I just avoid the question. I just avoid what she's talking about. Poop. He's chatting poop poop. Mm. I wanted a dog first. I said, babe, please give me a dog. And I kept getting promised, hey, babe, it's gonna come. Let me just get you a dog. We used to be a dog breeder. So he said, yeah, yeah, I'll get you a, a, a puppy from one of the litters. Da, 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 da. It's been almost a year now. I still haven't seen this puppy. Though. I don't know where it is. Maybe it's hiding somewhere. I haven't, I haven't seen it yet. So I said, okay, we have a fish tank because he had this fish tank all the time. Why not just get fish then? At least we're using it because it just kept sitting in the storage. And then he was like, okay, fine, we'll get the fish because clearly I'm looking after it so he doesn't have to do anything except feed them once in a blue moon. Mm. But I clean the. I agree with clean, that one. I clean their tank. I told that it's our responsibility if I get the fish. So. And I've been saying that any pet that we get, it will be my responsibility at the end of the day. Because I, uh, I yeah, okay, guy, guy. I asked him to say yes. She says it's going to be her, so but I told her, how about the finance? It's going to be her responsibility, financing yes. the, the the pets, yes. um, food, yes. and whatever they need. Yes. What you didn't say yes? That's yes. why I asked you. I'm no, yes you like. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying yes now. I thought about it. I want. I want. I want. I want. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Anyway, just allow it. <laughs> <laughs> you go Allow you it. go fish go and talk to your fish fishes <laughs> <laughs> take up ask them how's their day how are they doing you're not you know what i'm saying you're actually not serious is that the end that? of your our q and a mm -hmm. today mm -hmm. so guys if there's anything that we miss that you guys want to know more just let us know in the comment section and then maybe when we're doing our next q and a we'll be checking the comment section and then we'll write them down and then whenever we're doing our next Q&A, and then we can include it. 
Yeah. On the Q and A, and then I think whenever I want to do Q and A next time, we'll probably put um, a question or maybe on Instagram mm -hmm. or on Snapchat, mm -hmm. most of our a poll on most of our, our social media, and then let you guys ask what you want to do, and then we'll put it down and then yeah, and then yeah, yep. And if you have any ideas of what you'd like to see from us, let us know in the comment section below. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> And yeah, any we're here for you guys. Prank videos, challenges, mm -hmm. whatever. Just let us know in the comment section. This is what you want us to do. This is what you want to see, and we'll, we'll, do it. we'll give it to you because we are here for you guys. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. And once again, please like, comment, subscribe to our channel, and yeah, guys, share it with your mother, sister, brother, Pat. cousin. Father, sister, brother, auntie, cousin. Come on, come on now. Come on now. It doesn't matter anyway. Anyway, share guys, just everybody. share with everybody that you know. Share the love, guys. All right. No, did that hurt? <laughs> All right. Thank you, guys.